നമസ്കാരം മോക്ക് ടെസ്റ്റിൻ്റെ പുതിയ വീഡിയോയിലേക്ക് എല്ലാവർക്കും സ്വാഗതം ഇന്ന് ഇവിടെ ഡിസ്കസ് ചെയ്യുന്നത് ജൂനിയർ ലാബ് അസിസ്റ്റൻറ്റ് എക്സാമിലെ ഫിസിക്സ് പാർട്ടിൽ നിന്ന് വരുന്ന ക്വസ്റ്റ്യൻസ് ആണ് ഫസ്റ്റ് ക്വസ്റ്റ്യൻ ദ സിമ്പിൾ ടു പ്രസ റെപ്രസെൻ്റ് എമൗണ്ട് ഓഫ് സബ്സ്റ്റൻസ് ഈസ് ഡാഷ് ദ സിമ്പിൾ ടു റെപ്രസെൻ്റ് എമൗണ്ട് ഓഫ് സബ്സ്റ്റൻസ് ഈസ് ഡാഷ് ഓപ്ഷൻ എ കെ ഓപ്ഷൻ ബി എ ഓപ്ഷൻ സി സി ഡി ഓപ്ഷൻ ഡി മോൾ ദ സിമ്പിൾ ടു റെപ്രസെൻ്റ് എമൗണ്ട് ഓഫ് സബ്സ്റ്റൻസ് ഈസ് ഓപ്ഷൻ ഡി മോൾ ദ സിമ്പിൾ ടു റെപ്രസെൻ്റ് എമൗണ്ട് ഓഫ് സബ്സ്റ്റൻസ് ഈസ് മോൾ ദ സിമ്പിൾ ടു റെപ്രസെൻ്റ് എമൗണ്ട് ഓഫ് സബ്സ്റ്റൻസ് ഈസ് മോൾ വിച്ച് എമങ് ദ ഫോളോവിങ് ഈസ് ദ സപ്ലിമെൻ്ററി യൂണിറ്റ് വിച്ച് എമങ് ദ ഫോളോവിങ് ഈസ് ദ സപ്ലിമെൻ്ററി യൂണിറ്റ് ഓപ്ഷൻ എ മാസ് ഓപ്ഷൻ ബി ടൈം ഓപ്ഷൻ സി സോളിഡ് ആംഗിൾ ഓപ്ഷൻ ഡി ലോമിനോസിറ്റി വിച്ച് എമങ് ദ ഫോളോവിങ് ഈസ് ദ സപ്ലിമെൻ്ററി യൂണിറ്റ് ആൻസർ ഈസ് സി സോളിഡ് ആംഗിൾ സോളിഡ് ആംഗിൾ ഈസ് ദ സപ്ലിമെൻ്ററി യൂണിറ്റ് ദ സപ്ലിമെൻ്ററി യൂണിറ്റ് ഈസ് സോളിഡ് ആംഗിൾ വാട്ട് ഈസ് ദ യൂണിറ്റ് ഓഫ് സോളിഡ് ആംഗിൾ വാട്ട് ഈസ് ദ യൂണിറ്റ് ഓഫ് സോളിഡ് ആംഗിൾ ഓപ്ഷൻ എ സെക്കൻഡ് ഓപ്ഷൻ ബി സ്റ്റെറേഡിയൻ ഓപ്ഷൻ സി കിലോഗ്രാം ഓപ്ഷൻ ഡി കാൻഡ്ല വാട്ട് ഈസ് ദ യൂണിറ്റ് ഓഫ് സോളിഡ് ആംഗിൾ ആൻസർ ഓപ്ഷൻ ബി സ്റ്റെറേഡിയൻ സ്റ്റെറേഡിയൻ ഈസ് ദ യൂണിറ്റ് ഓഫ് സോളിഡ് ആംഗിൾ യൂണിറ്റ് ഓഫ് സോളിഡ് ആംഗിൾ സ്റ്റെറേഡിയൻ എ യു ഈസ് ദ യൂണിറ്റ് ഓഫ് ആസ്ട്രോണോമി യൂണിറ്റ് ഓപ്ഷൻ ബി ആസ്ട്രോണോമിക്കൽ യൂണിറ്റ് ഓപ്ഷൻ സി ആസ്ട്രോളജിക്കൽ യൂണിറ്റ് ഓപ്ഷൻ ഡി ആർക്കിയോളജിക്കൽ യൂണിറ്റ് എ യു ഈസ് ദ യൂണിറ്റ് ഓഫ് ഓപ്ഷൻ ബി ആസ്ട്രോണോമിക്കൽ യൂണിറ്റ് എ യു ഈസ് ദ യൂണിറ്റ് ഓഫ് ആസ്ട്രോണോമിക്കൽ യൂണിറ്റ് എ യു ഈസ് ദ യൂണിറ്റ് ഓഫ് ആസ്ട്രോണോമിക്കൽ യൂണിറ്റ് Dimensions of kinetic energy is the same as that of option A acceleration, option B velocity, option C work, option D force. Dimensions of kinetic energy is the same as that of option C work. Dimensions of kinetic energy is the same as that of work. Farad is the unit of dash. Farad is the unit of dash. Option A luminosity, option B wavelength, option C permittivity, option D inertia. Farad is the unit of option C permittivity. Farad is the unit of permittivity. Electron volts is an unit of electron volt is a unit of option A luminosity. Option B frequency, option C force, option D energy. Electron volt is a unit of energy. Electron volt is a unit of energy. Joule second is the unit of option A force, option B angular momentum, option C energy, option D power. Joule second is the unit of angular momentum. Joule second is the unit of angular momentum. The smallest value which is measured using an instrument is known as the smallest value which is measured using an instrument is known as absolute count, least count, round of value, minimum count. The smallest value which is measured using an instrument is known as option B, least count. the smallest value which is measured using an instrument is known as least count least count which is the system of unit which is the system of unit option a sms system option b mkp system option c fps system option d cjs system which is the system of unit answer option c fps system fps system 
FPS system is the system of unit. For the motion with the uniform velocity, the slope of the velocity tank graph is equal to option A 1 meter per second, option B 0, option C initial velocity, option D final velocity. For the motion with the uniform velocity, the slope of the velocity time graph is equal to option B 0. Answer option B 0. For the motion with the uniform velocity, the slope of the velocity time graph is equal to 0. The change in velocity corresponding to the time interval within which the change has accelerated is known as dash. Option A speed, option B instantaneous velocity, option C uniform motion, option D average acceleration. Answer is option D average acceleration. The change in velocity corresponding to the time interval within which the change has accelerated is known as average acceleration. A particle is moving with a constant speed along a straight line path. A force is not required to option A change its direction, option B decrease its speed, option C keep it moving with the uniform velocity, option D increase its momentum. A particle is moving with a constant speed along a straight line path. A force is not required to answer option C keep it moving with the uniform velocity. A particle is moving with a constant speed along a straight line path. A force is not required to keep it moving with the uniform velocity. Keep it moving with the uniform velocity. When the distance travelled by a body is proportional to the time taken, what happens to its speed? When the distance travelled by a body is proportional to the time taken, what happens to its speed? Option A becomes 0, Option B remains the same, Option C increases, Option D decreases. When the distance travelled by a body is proportional to the time taken, what happens to its speed? Option B remains the same. Answer Option B remains the same. When the distance travelled by a body is proportional to the time taken, its speed remains the same. Which is the formula for motion in a straight line? Option A, V is equal to U plus A T. B, V is equal to U minus A T. C, U is equal to 2 A T plus V. D, V is equal to 2 A T plus U. Which is the formula for motion in a straight line? Answer, option A, V is equal to U plus A T. The formula for motion in a straight line? V is equal to U plus A T. V is equal to U plus A T. Which among the following can be zero when a particle is in motion for some time? Which among the following can be zero when a particle is in motion for some time? Option A speed. Option B force. Option C time. Option D displacement. The correct answer is option D, displacement. Which among the following can be zero when a particle is in motion for some time? Option D, displacement. What is the net force of a kite that is held stationary in the sky? Option A, 1. Option B, increasing. Option C, 0. Option D, decreasing. What is the net, fo net force of a kite that is held stationary in the sky? Answer option B increasing. What is the net force of a kite that is held stationary in the sky? Answer increasing. Which is the branch of physics that deals with the motion of a body by considering the cause? Option A statics, option B thermodynamics, option C dynamics, option D astronomy. Which is the branch of physics that deals with the motion of a body by considering the cause? 
Answer Option C Dynamics. Dynamics is the branch of physics that deals with the motion of a body by considering the cause. The mass of a body which is equal to the ratio of the force acting on a body to the acceleration produced in the body is the option A gravitational force, option B electromagnetic force, option C internal mass, option D inertial mass. The mass of a body which is equal to the ratio of the force acting on a body to the acceleration produced in the body is answer option D inertial mass. The mass of a body which is equal to the ratio of the force acting on a body to the acceleration produced in the body is the inertial mass. When an external force is not applied to the system, its total momentum option A becomes zero, option B remains constant, option C increases gradually, option D decreases gradually. When an external force is not applied to the system, its total momentum remains constant. When an external force is not applied to the system, its total momentum remains constant. Answer is option B remains constant. Apparent weight of a body is equal to actual weight of the body. If the body is Option A moves with the increasing velocity, option B remains at rest, option C remains in a state of uniform motion, option D, option B and C. Apparent weight of a body is equal to actual weight of the body if the body remains at rest and remains in a state of uniform motion. The answer is option D, both B and C. Apparent weight of a body is equal to actual weight of the body. If the body remains at rest or remains in a state of uniform motion. Answer both B and C. Force acting for a short duration are called Option A short force, Option B interval force, Option C impulsive force, Option D interrupting force. Force acting for a short duration are called option C impulsive force. Force acting for a short duration are called impulsive force. The inherent property with which a body resists any change in its state of motion is known as option A force, option B momentum, option C inertia, option D acceleration. The inherent property with which a body resists any change in its state of motion is known as option C inertia. The inherent property with which a body resists any change in its state of motion is known as inertia. One newton is equal to option A. One newton is equal to one kg in one meter per second square. 1 newton is equal to 1 kg. Option C, 1 newton is equal to 1 kg in 1 meter per second. Option D, 1 newton is equal to meter per second square. The answer is option A, 1 newton is equal to 1 kg into 1 meter per second square. 1 newton is equal to 1 kg into 1 meter per second square. A block of wood is placed on a surface. A force is applied parallel to the surface to move the body. The frictional force developed acts as normal to the surface upwards option b normal to the surface downwards option c along the direction of applied force option d opposite to the direction of the applied force a block of wood is placed on a surface a force is applied parallel to the surface to move the body the frictional force developed acts opposite to the direction of the applied force opposite to the direction of the applied force the frictional force developed acts opposite to the direction of the applied force. Answer is option D, opposite to the direction of the applied force.